Okay, tell me about the um, health care in, in, in Europe again. Kenya, bud. Yeah, yeah. What would you say again about it? You said um, the taxes are high and people are poor and, and they can't find a job. I gave you an example about who the people, what some of the people over in Europe are facing. I'm going yeah. to tell you about the ones who don't have jobs. Okay. That's what I was telling you about. Okay. Yeah, because if you don't have a job, you can't pay any bills, right? Yeah, you can't. Okay. If you can't pay any bills, if you don't pay for your insurance, guess what? You, you just can't afford it. So you saying that um people in Europe, some people in Europe are poor and they can't afford it, and some who some who can't afford it, who can't afford it, that's what you're saying. Yeah, it's, <laughs> I don't care which country you go to, you're gonna find somebody over there that are falling to the cracks. Okay. I don't care what country it is. And if somebody tells you that a country has got it, they've got a perfect system, they're lying. Okay. There it is, and that shit. So the ACA isn't perfect either here, right? Well, no, it's not. The guy that put it in there, you know where the ACA came from? Yes. Who? Richard Nixon. No, no, no. It's not Richard Nixon, but um, I don't know where it Nick, came from. Well, Mick Romney. Uh, well, well, Mick Romney, okay. Yeah, he was the governor of Massachusetts. Okay. And he used it. So what Obama did is he got it and he saw it was, it was a good system if it was implemented right. But mm. he couldn't get it implemented completely. Because he was getting ready to get out of office. Mm -hmm. He got it passed. Okay. So along come the Republicans. And their thing is get rid of it all together. Okay, let me put all this together. Okay, um, the health care in Europe is not, the, the health care in countries in Europe are not perfect. And the ACA oh. isn't perfect. But um, Obama... Wants to get the AC, wants to wants to get the ACA and, and reduce premiums so people won't pay more in premiums, right? He wanted to fix it, so fix everybody it. would be covered and it would be a fair system. Okay. A fair but he couldn't get it done because of the Republicans and their and their and, 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 and their lobbying and their and these old redneck states like Texas and. Okay. That's what that's what it's about. Mm -hmm. It's just like the NRA. The the dog uh, those assault weapons and assault rifles, they're dangerous. They were made for war. They were made for you and me walking around on the streets with them. Mm -hmm. Going hunting with them. Okay. That assault rifle is not a good hunting weapon. Okay. Hey by the way huh? Hey by the way, um what did you get out of that video? I showed you from um from Winston Wu. Oh, the man is is what he was doing. It's just down in the United States talking about women and how they're hard to approach and all that stuff. What it is is somewhere along the line that man has a problem, you know, uh, uh, you know, you know, talking to women or getting along with women. I I got the I got the feeling. That when he was talking, that he don't like women very much. That's what I got out of it. And I got on something else out of it, too. And he doesn't really like the United States. Hmm. He doesn't really like it. He doesn't? No, he doesn't. Because the way he said, what, 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 what are you saying? If you say, okay, you talk to me, and say, all right, you were terrible. But this guy over here is good. 
He does this. He does that. Everything he does is good. But, they, but you are bad. But that's basically what he's saying about the United States. It is bad. But if you go to Canada, if you go to Europe, he didn't, he, he, didn't, he didn't say about he didn't say anything about going to Canada. Canada is similar to the U.S. Well, what he was saying, Richard, basically that the United States is a terrible place, and that uh, if you go to Europe, it's a better place. If you go to the Orient, it's a better place. But he, but he didn't say like all of Europe is perfect. But he just say some some countries like um the Scandinavian countries like um Norway, Sweden, Denmark. Um, I don't think the Scandinavian countries um are are not are not great places to to meet people and talk to people and meet women. That's that's yeah that's what he said. I mean he didn't say all of Europe is perfect or sociable. That's that's what he said. He the United States bad. Yes, he did, cause well, well, he's telling the truth about how how the U.S. is. I mean, but my my thing is, he was he was he wasn't born in the United States, was he? No, he wasn't. He was born in Taiwan. He was and he, he and his parents brought him. He, him and his parents moved to the U.S. Man, my question is, why don't he go back to Taiwan? If you think they're so great, when well, you go to those countries that he's saying are so great, well, there comes the question. Because well, what I've seen of him, he can afford to go there. Mm -hmm. He probably can speak the language. But why did he stay in the United States and complain about it? Well, he just well he well. He just did a little research. He just went over, went overseas to to countries in Europe, and you know, and just you know, and just and just did some investigating of how people are here, how people are over there, and then he compare that with people here. Now, that's that's what he that's what he was doing. I mean, I mean, if the U.S. wasn't the way it is, I mean, he would be saying some positive things about it. I mean. strike me as a person he's like uh what's that old crazy guy uh he was he was on fox tv rush limbaugh you know when obama got the president he said before if obama was elected president he's gonna move to canada yeah did he move to canada uh no he didn't oh well, he did he stayed right here because okay. he knew Where it was the best one. Okay. Hey, I remember a long time ago you told mother that um after I graduated from high school, you told her that uh, I'm not a people person. Well, remember talking to people, with you. What? Yeah, I'm trouble conversing with people. Me? Yeah. I have trouble talking to people. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you well, know, well, what's my problem? It's just a matter of you learning how to convert the people, that's it. I don't know how to convert the people. Converse. Converse. Talk. Yeah. Well, I'm talking to you. Yeah. <laughs> You're talking to me, but that's because you know me. So I don't talk to anybody else, right? Well, you came up here today and said you were you were looking for somebody to talk to. Yeah. So you saying so I'm so 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 saying? basically you saying I'm antisocial, right? No. See, there you go. You you, you put a word in my mouth again. I never said it was antisocial. Antisocial is a person that is a complete introvert. In other words, he doesn't want to reach out to anybody. He doesn't want to. And, you know, interact with anybody. Okay, um, what you're saying, what, what you're saying, I'm going to, well, I'm going to try again. Um, what you're saying is, um, 
you saying that uh, well okay um there's there's some people who are who are autistic you know and they and they can't communicate with anybody so you saying that uh, I'm I'm like them I'm autistic no I didn't say you was autistic either okay autistic see- is in the word that I use and I would you okay. so I don't really like that that, that word Richard you don't autistic what does it mean to be autistic Richard have you seen anybody they say was autistic and seen how they act? Hmm. Huh? Um, Asperger's, Asperger's, I can't pronounce the word Asperger's, something like that. Uh-huh. But so you so you saying that I, I can't convert with anybody? I say you have trouble with it. I didn't say you couldn't. Trouble with it? Expl- I mean, you know, in other words, you talk to people, but you really... What it seems to me is that you really don't like doing. I don't like doing what? Talking to people. I don't like talking to people. Yeah, because you talk like you remember what you said about uh, 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 Gerard and his wife. Remember that? Yeah. What you say about him? It was weird. I mean, I mean, I mean, I tried to talk to him, but he wouldn't say anything to me. He came and seen you, didn't he? Yeah, he did. And did he talk to you then? Yes, he did. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. So I don't like... Did you, did you send a, a friend request out to me? No, I didn't. Yes, it did. It just came up. You said Richard Lyle wants to be friends with you. Well, yeah, I started a you. I started a a, a, f- a Facebook page. I'm not very familiar with it. Um, Angie showed me how to use it, but um, she just wanted me to just, just to figure it out. Yeah, just be careful about what you say on there. Okay. Okay. Because the people from Homeland Security see they monitor this stuff and mess around and say the wrong thing, and they think you, uh, you know, you're a terrorist. Might get a knock on your door, man. I'm just saying. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, so be careful. Co- conversion. Oh, be- okay, so I'm, I'm conversive because um, I have trouble speaking to people, right? And meaning that I don't like talk. I don't like talking to people. Do you? Yeah, I do. Okay then. So if I say, okay, so I so if I say I'm not going to talk to that person anymore, I can't stand. I'm going to like him, so I'm I'm conversive, right? Conversive? Yeah. Uh, no, conversive. That day, day of what conversive is, Richard. Okay. When you say you can't, you don't want to talk to that person anymore. You see, but, okay, you say that I have trouble talking to people. Yeah, because you get angry. Remember, I was at the church, that one girl, that old, that old girl didn't want to, I don't know what she said to you or what she did or whatever. But right after that, you stopped going to church. Mm-hmm. Remember that? Yeah. Okay. And that's what I'm talking about. What happened? Well, uh, well, oh yeah. Um, well, I, I well, I approached her the wrong way. I don't know how to talk to women. I, I extended my hand out. She just slapped it and walked away. So, yeah, I, I talked about it. And I didn't, and that's not the reason why I'm. I stopped going to church. Is it's the reason why? Well, um, the people there um are antisocial. You know, some of the people there are antisocial. So yeah, um, they don't okay. want to. They don't want to talk to me. So I just stopped. Okay. I just stopped going to church. I mean.
Okay, um, okay, you saying that I stopped going to church because, because of this girl who made me angry and I didn't want to, I, and I just stopped going. Yeah, yeah Richard, that's what you told me. No, I think that's not what I told you, I mean, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I I extended my empathy. Well, I don't know how to talk to women, so yeah. Okay. Okay. And you know All something. Right. And you know something. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna be like Elliot Rogers. I'm not gonna grab a gun. I'm not gonna go in a mass shooting. I'm not, I'm not gonna do anything like that. No way. Yeah. At all. Uh, I pray God that you don't. Yeah. But if I did, but but if I did, you wouldn't have no clue why I did what I did. You can, you, why I did what I did. But I'm not gonna do that at all. Okay. Well, listen, I gotta study my my, my sermon for Sunday. Yeah. Cause it's, it's getting late. Okay. <sighs> okay. Yes. Uh, okay, but just remember what I said. Okay. Okay. There's no perfect system. None. I'm gonna give okay. you some. I'm to give you some advice too. Um, What's that? Okay. If you look, okay, okay, you pray, okay, you prayed to God, and you told me this. Um, pray to God, believe in God, read the Bible. Uh -huh. Um. So um if I if I do that then you know I will that I will speak the truth about everything. I mean I will see things the way they are and I'm gonna speak the truth. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sugarcoat anything and I'm not gonna lie. So yeah. And, 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 it, and it's not gonna it's not gonna be from your it's not gonna be from your perspective or anybody else's perspective in America. It's gonna be it's gonna it's gonna be true, it's gonna be Winston Wu true. How you know Winston Wu is true? Well yes. Uh, that's 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 what I'm gonna uh, that's what I believe in. Yes. Believe in him. You don't believe in God. I believe in God. I believe, well, yeah, I, I believe in God. Yes. Does he? He believes in God too. Mm. But um. Well, well, that's a but but he's not backwards on on what he's saying. You're kind of backwards. But you know what? Um, I'm not. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Well, I'm not, I'm not gonna bash you on what you believe in. You know, I'm gonna say this. I mean, you can believe what you want to believe. You know, it's. I mean, that's what you believe. Hey, I mean, I'm not gonna get angry at you about that. It is what it is. Okay. Okay. But okay, man. Let me get on this sermon. Okay. All right. All right. You have a good night, man. Okay. Bye bye. Bye.